Hello, my beautiful Leos. Welcome to one of our special readings, a timeless reading. As you see it now, or you will see it later, that's the time you gotta see this specific energies. Your next happy moment, darlings, or what will cheer you up soon? Speaking about the soon energy could be as we speak, in the moment, or in the next three months up to six months. Okay, no longer than that. So let's see, loves, what this is for and how this will project to you, to your energy. And of course, if you enjoy this reading or this reading brings you any clarity, please let us know, comment below as well. If you feel free, share with others to know this information. All right, your next happy moment for you and what will cheer you up. We have the judgment. Many times judgment speaks about the coming back or could be an awakening moment or could be about a past life energy. But what I'm feeling here is now is a situation that you know exactly what you should do next. If you've been confused related to some kind of situation or person or energy, you will be crystal clear what you should do next about it. Yes, Queen of Wands, Ten of Wands. Speaking about clarity, if you've been in some kind of situation here in a back and forth for over two years, let's say two months for some of you, two years, and you are keep overthinking it or keep being anxious about it, what if? I don't feel you are going to doubt. For some of you, you could keep this energy because being fearful or feel like I, I don't want to make a big mistake. Six of Pentacles and Knight of Pentacles and Nine of Wands here. I feel here now you are going to make this decision. It's kind of if somebody here is not clear, you are going to be clear. For some of you, somebody needed to make a decision. They did not. And now it's your turn. Nine of Wands and the Will. So something here can't stay where it is or can't go any longer the way it used to. So definitely here what will cheer you up is a decision making, being clear what you should do and not waiting any longer because something here needs to move forward. Does the universe will? Does the divine timing? Here we are. Let's see more about it. Queen of Swords, Two of Wands, Seven of Wands. It's kind of I make a decision and I'm gonna stick with that decision. Six of uh, Cups, yes. So now you do know here was the seven of wands because I feel here there was so much resistance between whatever here to do or how to do. Another queen. So we have three queens. The only queen is missing here, Leo. It's queen of cups. And queen of cups is... For some of you, could be a mother figure or could be in regards to mother energy. And sometimes Queen of Cups is, you know, your heart didn't let you to make this decision or, or felt like maybe there's other things. For some of you, could be a mother figure here needs to make a decision in related to their children or their child. Or a situation they've been through. Could be about the work they used to do. Or how they used to. Yeah. 
Five of Wands. Here it is. We have a Page of Cups, but we do not have the Queen. So for some of you, you could entertain some kind of energy, you know, unconsciously. Yes, Ten of Swords. That could gone to to the point that you you need to stop. King of Wands. For some of you is related to the children or to the other half. What's the Queen of Swords here for? Three of Pentacles, King of Swords, wow. So for some reason, certain things here did work for a while or for, for a good time, but not any longer. Did somebody here left? Because I feel here somebody here left. Yeah, I feel here also there is a there is some someone here in the mix. We have a page of pentacles and a page of cups and a knight of pentacles. For some of you, somebody here left you out with everything and anything on your shoulders. Now they might want to come back. Or now they want to make right, but you are not quite sure. The Six of Cups, Five of Swords. Ace of Cups. King of Cups. Yeah, this person, whoever here stay, it's like somebody here that... I'm, I'm hearing a lost soul. And this soul could be a person you are dealing. They always find, look for other things. For other people to entertain. Other things to do. But never do the right thing. Never stick with one thing. They always try other energies. And I feel here this person could come around pretending or telling you that they changed or they love you. It's it's a big BS, to be honest. And why it's so? Because this person didn't change not even a teeny tiny bit. This person, it's like, um, I don't want to call them this way, but I feel here this person always took advantage of your good heart or of your money even. Because you could uh, care about them. You could keep them up with the things. You could keep up with the bills and so on. But this person kind of like enjoy other pleasures in their own life. So if you try to cut them off from something or certain things, that's what they don't like it. But what will cheer you up if you made a, a radical decision or some kind of decision? That will cheer you up. And Spirit says you made a right good decision. And somebody here doesn't feel like it's the right one. Yes, because somebody here suck, suck up all your money. Could be a Capricorn energy here, doesn't necessary. But it's kind of cutting off from from the budget or from your money or from something you you definitely are getting in a better energy on your own somebody here could also gone through certain uh, addictions and you could pay their debts yeah king of pentacles yeah, they, they will feel left out, they will feel like this and that, but 
I feel here, yeah, this person could be your ex or someone you are dealing. But you uh, make a decision to, to be happy. So that will cheer you up. It's kind of you, you cut off a very toxic, negative energy from your life. I feel also this person might give you some kind of headache. Don't get me wrong. But it seems here that will change a lot of things. Even your whole life. In such a good way that you, you probably don't expect. What's about 8 years? For some of you, you could be 8 years with this person. Or been 8 years since you've been back and forth with this person. For others of you, 16 years but i see the eight years very very loud the number eight is very loud or this is the year that you can't go any longer the way you used to what advice we have for you from spirit here you are the empress you you just want to be free from this person because you you keep yourself in a very small energy to the point that you can grow yes for some of you you keep you keep helping this person getting out from the troubles but no more so you are moving on from a situation that kept you like this eight of swords stuck and kind of hopeless into the energy of a winning overcoming energy moving forward and also growing it's like now you are gonna see results if you making money you will see that you actually have money because for for some reason it seems like you get money, you spread them out, but now you actually can have them. But you used to spread them out because there were so many things around you. But yeah, you you are gonna feel free. Because six of wands is yes, like you're winning a case, you could. You could win a case with this person. But for many of you, you are getting out from this cage this person brought on your shoulders. For others of you, you are Winning your own freedom. Freedom for life. Freedom to grow. Freedom to expand. Freedom to be with whoever you want to be. That's a lot. And it's kind of for some of you, you, you can move from a situation that, oh boy, kept you in a place where you did not sign up for. And yes, that's movement. For some of you, you could move even from a place that you actually can extend. For some of you, this is not a person. This could be a job that kept you. Yes, there's a title out there, but there is no benefit. There's no any fulfillment. Because for some of you, it's a job. And you're moving from this job to become an owner or a, or an entrepreneur whatever here is you are not gonna stay stuck and yes there's a lot of changes here if you are leaving a job to be an entrepreneur my darling you have so much expansion you just have no idea but somebody here will be very sad losing you. And they will try. They will try to come back. But yeah, you are free like a bird. Good job, darlings. So Leos, that will cheer you up, darlings. You are free. You definitely are free. And your life is about to change 180 degrees. Congrats. See you, loves. Many blessings. Till the next time. Bye for now.